We are back with continuing coverage of Hurricane Irene. One thing to remember, there are a lot of people who were ordered to get out of where they are. Evacuations underway in Norfolk, about 100,000 people may have to move out. But there are a lot of people, too, who have chosen to stay. So what do you do if you've decided to stay? Stephanie Harris uh, tells us more about how we should handle that. Now, here are a few tips to hopefully make things a little more livable in your house while the electricity is out. If you have some empty juice or milk containers, fill them up with water and put them in your freezer now before the electricity goes out. Then you can use them to help keep your food fresh for longer. Also, if you have an ice maker, continue to make as much ice as you can right now. Then you can put all the ice into your washing machine. Use it as a giant cooler. It's perfect because all the water just drains out with no mess. Before the storm rolls in, fill your bathtub with water. You can put some in a bucket and use it to flush your toilet. You can do the same thing in the sink and use this water to brush your teeth or take a sponge bath. And finally, if you're anything like me, this is a really great tip. Tomorrow morning when you get up to make coffee, make a few extra pots and put them in a thermos. They'll stay hot maybe up to like 9 or 10 hours. This could be a real lifesaver. Stephanie Harris, 10 on your side. A lot of really good tips there. Yeah, especially the washing machine idea. Yeah, I kind of like that. Really, really good. We're going to take a break. We'll be right back.